What's, What's good, y'all? It's the Dumashat, Saria, and we're back, back with another video. video. Who we got today, see? Today we're back with another American Reaction. Super excited about this video. If you're new to us, and, and we're new to you, you, make sure you scroll down, hit, hit that subscribe, subscribe button, button, and turn on the post notification bell, because we're, we're on the road to 200K. And we cannot get there without you guys, all right? Join the family. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Door from my town to my school. My school is in Stockholm. It takes about one and a half hour, one hour and a quarter, somewhere around there. But it's actually quite nice because the buses are really good and really nice, and the public transport works really well. And also, the bus that I'm going the longest with do have Wi Fi. So it's pretty good, it's pretty good. One of the best things with the public transport in in Stockholm, I don't know. I'm sure other towns have it too, but it is that you can check reality time, I guess you would call it. Like real time. Um, so you can click on a bus stop and then check when how far away your bus is. And then it's like, oh, five minutes away. And then you know you gotta hurry or not, you know. It's really good. So I always check that before I go off the bus so I know if I'm gonna run or not. Today I don't really need to run, so it's fine. <laughs> and over there we got Max to the left and that's like McDonald's or Burger King only that it's like 100 times better. How cool they are. How cool they are. So the buses, you always have your little car that you blip on all the buses and metro and trains and everything in the whole Stockholm. And the an hour away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She mentioned I think like an hour and a half. To a high school. To go to school, yeah. That's crazy. Whoa. That's crazy. That's what I said. I would have fell asleep on that bus. But you get mm -hmm. on two buses and I see so there's no sleep. Yeah, see our highs our schools, period, are near our homes if you want to go to another school you know you gotta you gotta be zoned for it yeah you have to be zoned for it or you have to get approval to go to that school yeah. and then you can you'll have to deal with your own transportation yeah, most correctly. likely because the buses ain't gonna run that far unless right. you're getting on a city bus right if the city bus will go that far the route the timing that route yeah that's a lot that's different. Yeah, our way, no, that's that's unheard of. Yeah. I mean, if y'all from a bigger city, like Baltimore or, or somewhere up north, because I don't see that happening down south. Mm. Y'all got to let us know. But our way? Mm. Mm -mm. This, this sign is what I missed, like, so much in New Zealand. Because when you, when you went somewhere on the bus and you didn't know what bus stop to get off on, then you had to talk to the, the driver. But here you can see which bus stop is the next, and then you can press stop and you know where you are. Heather is a badass of Sikta for a gambling platter. Breaking the law, breaking the law. The Igor was five weeks. Five weeks? Igor was five weeks. It's only five weeks to the, to the graduation, she's, she's saying. So now we're arriving at my beautiful school that looks like a, I don't know what, a stone. It's Tegelsten, Tegelsten in Swedish. Um, it's an old fabric, so that's why. But it's not that nice on the outside, maybe, but it's like super nice on the inside and it's modern and it's cozy. And we're actually late to class, as usual, I have to say, sadly. Our school is always locked because it's super secure it's not that it needs to be but it is and we got some lockers and everyone have their own lockers here we always go with the same class every day so you have the same people that you have all the your classes with so we're pretty we're pretty close to each other we always use computers and we use google drive which is really I, I think it's working so, so well. And this class is called, uh, I don't even know how to explain it, but it is like how the, how the culture stuff uh, and how the art uh, affects the, the society, pretty much. So now I finished first class and we're going for lunch, because here in Sweden we get free lunch every day in school from the like, I don't know, from kindergarten till, till last grade, which is now. 
here's the cafeteria. Mm -hmm. You can buy stuff. Y'all look like they treat y'all like y'all on a college campus. Because mm -hmm. that's what a lot of college campuses look like from what I understand. Yeah. Well, most of them. I don't know they have different setups, but this one's more of the similar side. Yeah, okay. Pretty so they're going to a whole buffet. I would talk about our school lunches. First of all, Louisiana got good school lunches. But secondly, I can't really talk about our school lunches because what I have seen in the recent years, upgrade. Yeah. Yeah, just speaking in our area alone, they just built a new high school, state-of-the-art football field. Mm. The cafeteria, they have almost every restaurant in Texas in, oh, the, yeah, yeah, in the cafeteria. Yeah. Fast that. food restaurant. So I can't talk about the fast food no more. I mean, the school food no more. Because yeah. they upgrading. Yeah, they happy with that, though. Mm -hmm. Can we leave our stuff? All the dishes and stuff. And because it is like a lovely day and the sun is pretty warm, warmer than usual, then we're gonna buy some ice cream because we have this. Uh, what is it called? Stat oil. Stat oil. What is it called in English? Okay, one big difference I could see. What's that? My high school. We couldn't go outside when we wanted to. Mm. Mm -mm. Leaving campus? Oh, oh automatic right up. <laughs> definitely not. No. You have out. to be with a teacher at all times. I don't know if it's because of, you know, security issues, but we just could not walk outside like that. So y'all couldn't just like go from A to B while class is going on? Not outside. All the classes were inside. You had to have a permission slip or something? You could not go outside. You had no No no, no reason, reason to be outside at all. Nope. You couldn't go to your car. You, you could not go outside. Oh, yeah. Them rules would have been broke. Yeah, but your school, y'all could go outside? I mean, I'm thinking about it. Not really. No. Like, if you're going, if you say you're going somewhere, you have to go there. Mm -mm. You know what I'm saying? No, like, but you need permission for it. Like, you have to raise your hand, ask the teacher you can do this or the third. And if she want to let you go, then she will let you go. Other than outside? that. Outside? Again. It was so long ago. <laughs> it was so long I, ago. Look, I can go all the way back to, like, like when we had A days and B days and recess would be on A days and you got the second recess on B days. Some people not go to class because they want to be on the B recess. Just go See, have fun. Our, you know? our, it wasn't called recess in high school. But I'm thinking about another grade level. Yeah, our lunch period, that was our recess, was indoors. It was like the common area of the school. Yeah, that was a long time ago for me. Yeah, I'm thinking you gotta about think it like, of, See, your high school, I thought y'all can go outside. My high school... All of our classes and stuff was inside. The only time I went outside was for band. Because I had a band class and we had to go outside to practice on the field. Or PE when we went yeah, I mean, on, that's, the, on that field. So, yeah, that's common. Going outside for athletic activities yeah, and stuff. Track, running around. We didn't have no reason to be outside. Gosh. Well, no reason. I'm sorry about that. I know. I used to feel <laughs> like a prisoner. Saying, bruh. <laughs> Shoot. Now, Circle K. So he has the gas station. Gas station. And where you can buy ice cream. And it's right next to the store. Swedish ice cream, folks. That one is like the best one, but it's pretty expensive. No, if you if you if you were a senior and you came to school half day, that's when, yeah, basically. When you leaving, you go outside when you're leaving. Okay, that's well, kind of sim similar to, to us as well. We didn't have that to where we could just leave class, walk around, and do as we please. No. Unless you just wanted them. Mm -mm. So, yeah, I'm we out. We could not walk around. It was straight school. Lunch, school. That's it. Well, that's kind of like I said. All right, you need permission slip, you get right up for it, or don't you get caught. Know, you want to know the time that we had freedom, but we still couldn't go outside? We was cool with a teacher, and they knew mm -hmm. you was walking down the hall, and they let you go anyway. Yeah, I did those too. See? But, mm -hmm. no, the last day of school. Last As year a schools. senior, yeah, literally I think my was, last day of grade school. I mean, somebody can fact check me, but I really think it was similar. You think? Yeah. I always thought your your like your district was more lenient. Our district was very strict. No, I don't think so. The <laughs> thing is that it's like maybe eight degrees outside, like so it's this. not that it's warm really. really. Like this. But for sweet, it's really warm. So we're gonna sit outside and enjoy the sun. We're talking about like um, which song that we're gonna run out to. Like when you graduate, it's like a huge thing in Sweden. 
and you run out from school and your parents is in the grass and stuff and you get to pick a song and it's a big discussion so now we have like I guess you would call it tutor class uh, I think it was called in New Zealand at least but like you decide stuff and get information uh, but our teacher isn't there so we're gonna just decide on our own which song we're gonna run out to and uh, other stuff that have to do with the graduation because it's a lot of orga organizing and my English isn't working so okay so my last day of school last day as a senior in high school we had our class song that that we picked freshman year that came on the intercom and they let us out of the um build they let us out of class earlier than everybody else in the school y'all ain't have no tradition like that do i remember being a senior <laughs> did i graduate i mean it was long ago but it wasn't that long ago yes you did graduate yeah i know i'm right. just joking but uh, that, was, that was a long time ago i don't really Got too much of a memory with all that. You know, you didn't care about you a boy. Y'all don't care about stuff like that. I like tradition, so yeah. Let's carry on. <laughs> Our teacher just gave us like three new tasks to do, and uh, we are pretty stressed out already. Um, and we have to do them in two hours, and it's a lot. I'm gonna just show you a little bit around because I'm not doing the task that I'm actually actually supposed to be doing anyway. Uh, but here is our TV studio, so we are here quite a lot, and it's like, it's like look a spot at those out a lot. Yeah, big it's lamps, it's called, all the cameras here, and stuff like that, you know, and everything you need for a TV studio. Because I'm going the media program, like in Sweden, you go the first nine years of school, everyone have the same subjects in whole Sweden, and then you choose like a program. And we have chosen the media program, so we're doing a lot of video making, and photography, and graphics, and those kind of stuff. So yeah. And I, we have like... been in the same field, see? I like graphics. You would have been out walking in there, just go talk to the graphic teacher. What did I choose? No, no, I didn't choose the correct thing. And I just stayed in there for whatever reason. I don't know why. I chose nursing. I really, really mm. thought that. I don't know. We didn't have like a law. Like we didn't have criminal justice. I everybody was doing nursing. Though, yeah, too. I did nursing. Everybody was doing that. Until I realized I don't like blood. I don't know why I chose that. And it was like I still had the electives that I wanted. Like publications, yearbook, yeah. mass communications. I still had those electives. But that wasn't the track that I was on. Heard that. What Heard you was that. doing? Uh, as in before I graduated? Yeah, the, the track you was on. I was going with architect, gra graphics. Oh, okay. Stuff like that. Uh, yeah. yeah. That's cool. Mm. We're still learning things. Mm. Almost a decade of marriage. <laughs> <laughs> we had like a green screen and stuff. I think you knew so that, it's pretty, though. It's pretty good and I mean, well done. And yeah, we had like cameras. Track, and was, yeah, we had a whole conversation. You didn't know the track, but you knew like what I was going for in college was just yeah, similar yeah, to was what I was coming high out of school, high school for. Yeah, I was talking about high school, though. Yeah, so you knew. I didn't know about the high school. Same. The reception that we can get all the time if we want to, and stuff like that. As you noticed, we only had two or, well, two and a half classes today. That's but love. it's because my school have decided that they want to have very long classes. So one class could be two and a half hours, maybe. And it works so well. I love it because you actually get to get into your stuff and do your work for a longer time. And I don't know, it just fits me. It was a really aesthetic day because I do, I do have, I do have Swedish and math and you know the basic stuff too and like history and stuff like that. That's interesting because she was like, I do have Swedish and I'm like, what's she talking about? But I'm thinking we we call our language English, okay, like the class English, English. class, yeah. So oh, it, wow. like it's it just so <sighs> ingrained in us. So it's like memory like, unlocks just keep <laughs> happening right now for me. I'm like, gosh, yeah, you're right. Yeah. That's exactly how it was. <laughs> But Thursday is a really, really arty day. Oh, <laughs> so the last say, class was like steady communication. <clears throat> but I wanted to say, um, is she done with I her day? I think she's done with her day, y'all. Okay, let it play and then I'm going to say my comment. Hold on. And we do different arty stuff. Hey, Uni. Hey. <laughs> yeah, I think she's done with her so day. That's Uni. My yeah, that's a wrap for her. That was a cool school day with them. Yeah. Okay, so I wanted to say it's <clears throat> differently per school. But my high school, our classes were 90 minutes long. Don't ask me how I still remember that. I still got questions. But it was 90 minutes, and I believe we had four 
classes a day. Are you serious? What? About your schoolwork? Yeah. We had four classes a day, I believe. Something like that. Yeah. That's how it was. Four, four, four classes. Y'all didn't have the seven classes? We split it. Y'all had A and B in high school? Don't ask no more questions. <laughs> Because I really don't remember, but it's similar to what you're saying, because it kind of get bring me, and I'll, I really hate to be wrong about this, because it was a, a year to remember, you know what you I'm saying? You don't care about that stuff, like I, I care, I just it. don't, like, it, it was so long ago, and it's not many things that I can really go back on when it comes to that. Right. Yeah. Even our son, no. Like, he had, I don't know, I forgot. I've got. Hey. But yeah, that seemed like a cool school day. You know, some differences, but most of it seemed the same. I yeah. mean, the freedom was the, the I think most the difference. Yeah, and then having like codes on the door and stuff. I don't think we ever had that in high school. Did we? My, oh my God, again, no, here we go. No, did did y'all have was it? always lock, yeah. Y'all had codes where you had to... No, we didn't have code. We couldn't put in no code. We don't know no code for you the You had to school. hit the intercom button or something yes, and they would buzz y'all in. Yes, and they had to in. Do we have that? And we, then I we think had all to go through had two that. separate doors. I think all schools had that. Yeah. Like, Some schools even had like them, um, the monitors where they got to beep you in to yeah. see if you got any things on you. Oh, we didn't, we didn't have that. See, that okay, was on okay. special days. Okay. Surprise days where they came in with the dogs. I think, and with just the, think they kept all doors locked. They kept we live in America. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, yeah, this was cool. It was. You know, we hope you guys enjoyed this video with us. Like this video, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell. We have enabled our super, super thanks. thanks if you like to support the channel that way, as well as our reaction request form is in our description, description box, box below. below. We'll see you soon. Peace. Peace.